They are so kind and I'm not good at speak English, so they are help me and then they teach English, so they are so kind and they are so thank you. Thank you. <laughs> good. I have a lot of friends. And they are nice and kind, mm -hmm. and I love nature. I think there's not a lot of students, so like the teacher can help you with your studies and stuff, like um, directly, you know? Mm -hmm. I mean? Yeah. Like easier, mm -hmm. not a lot of students. Yeah. And like, it's so peaceful, mm. not, yeah. not, not so chaos or like, in the class, they're not, there's not a lot of students, yeah. My body is very different from Japanese school. Mm -hmm. uh, like, she's uh, quite free. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, which is good for me. Okay. Um, I think Japanese school is more... All the students are like really focused, mm -hmm. like always doing their work and always studying. Um, whereas New Zealand, it's a bit more relaxed, yeah. um, which I found quite different. Um, it wasn't too hard for me to adjust, but yeah, it was good. Like in Thailand, you cannot choose what which subjects you want to study uh, about. Yeah. yeah, here like you can choose whatever you want to study. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think, and and like. And the second thing is like the uniform things and like New Zealand school do do have the uniform, mm -hmm. but in Thailand we we have more than that. We do have uniform, but like we have to cut your hair short, uh, or have to do makeup or now uh, it's it's more strict. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, the school in Italy was very different, so. It was much stricter. Mm -hmm. um, the way of teaching was different as well. It was we only wrote notes. We didn't do worksheets. We didn't do like uh, practical things. Mm -hmm. It was just always writing. And the classes were always silent. Yeah. Okay. Are they like friendly? Yeah, the people were super super friendly. Um, it was easy for me to make friends. Oh. But it was. I definitely had to be more extroverted and. Make conversations. Uh, Japanese schools seem to be more disciplined. Like, um, yeah, I don't know how you explain it, but um, they seem to be a lot more active and seem to be doing a lot more schoolwork than what we do here. Like, really busy, busy mm -hmm. lives, yeah. 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 What about you? Oh, Sam, Sam. <laughs> <laughs> Good much, yeah. It was difficult to understand the content of a class. Um, speaking English is hard for me. Okay. Um, in, I'd say, the second and third month, I got quite homesick. Um, um, just because it was so different. Mm -hmm. and, yeah, I missed my friends and my family. Um, but it just took a little bit to adjust to the new culture and after that it was, mm. it was fine. Also, learning a new language was difficult. Um, um, having school and I kind of like understood nothing at first. Mm. Um, yeah, it was hard for that. But. Mixed um, Maori language and yeah. mixed English. So, yeah, it's too difficult, but now I can. <laughs> You're enjoying it? Oh, yeah, I enjoy it. Yeah. When I come to New Zealand, I don't know how to make friends, so I always, I always thinking about this because I want to speak English well. So yeah, yeah. When I come to New Zealand, it was so difficult to make friends. Now you got many friends? Yeah, yeah, many. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So, nice. It's just beginning, so. Uh, <laughs> Like I, I think they they got me they they helped me a lot. Mm -hmm. Like helped me out a lot because so it's like they helped me by like having some chit chat after class. Mm -hmm. Like 
how I was doing in the class and like and yeah asking me like am I doing okay with the class am I understand everything and I, I think that helped me a lot and yeah and I think teams had a lot of help oh yeah yeah mm, sure. yeah it's helpful I think the body system is good even if uh, I didn't understand English uh, they kindly told me mm -hmm. uh, for example we move between classrooms uh, there are many classrooms but they will work together uh, it's very helpful because the school is large okay um, I had an amazing host family mm -hmm. who always made sure that I was okay. Mm -hmm. um, a good group of friends too. And uh, I went with AFS, the next Exchange Company, and we had um, volunteers who would take us out if we thought if we were lonely or they'd always kind of mm -hmm. check, just making sure that we're okay, that mm -hmm. we have things to do, that you know we we know what we can, <laughs> what if we know, <laughs> yeah, just making sure that everything's mm -hmm. fine. Did you understand all the content of classes? Uh, no, I, under I didn't understand a lot of things. Mm -hmm. The classes were very different. Um, my Italian was was pretty good, but mm -hmm. um, technical terms like when I was doing biology or uh, philosophy, like mm -hmm. I didn't really understand mm -hmm. what was going on. How did you understand those? I had I would always write down words that I didn't know. And so after the classes, I could go online and see what they meant, and then I could write my own notes uh, that way. Good. But also asking questions as well. Oh, okay. Good. In storytelling class, my draft was full of grammar mistakes, but my friends tried to understand, and Miss Goldie fixed all of them Although the class is over. Uh, uh, in the after school, Miss Hartron taught me about the content of, of the class individually. Then it helped me. Master, Miss Donna, um, Barbara gave me uh, when I didn't uh, understand the tasks uh, in the literacy class. Oh, 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 o